then you know just how difficult it could be and demanding. Imagine being elderly, disabled, and having nothing left in the bank to make those repairs. Sounds hopeless, and for some seniors it would be, were it not for the efforts of one local organization. Darwin Singleton has tonight's McConnell Automotive Charity Spotlight. NBC 15 Charity Spotlight is sponsored by McConnell Automotive. They came to the house on Houston Street in Mobile to fix some peeling and rotting exterior boards. Time and weather had certainly taken their toll. But then the crew from Catholic Social Services discovered there was even more to do, much more. We did yard cleanup. We did the painting, as you can see here. We're painting in another house. Uh, we did some to uh, plumbing work for a lady who had a toilet, hadn't worked in years. She's, she's of course, alone. She's got, uh, she's one leg and she's confined to a wheelchair. It's a familiar story for those who volunteer for Catholic Social Services Home Repair Program, part of the St. Teresa of Calcutta's Ministry for People 65 and Older, which helps with deliveries of food and medicine, but... We also um, have an obligation to make sure that they are safe in their home, and we find a lot of different things that are small things to the average person, but make a lot of difference. Yeah. You know, putting on a new faucet handle, yeah, painting your home if it hadn't been painted in 20 years, installing a new um, toilet or vanity. At this home, the floor needed repairs and doorways needed to be widened. And there is help from fresh volunteers, including these two seminary students from Minnesota. She's disabled, missing a leg. She's an 86-year-old woman confined to a wheelchair. Um, these are the things that might seem less important, but for people like her, it makes a big difference. Who are the people Catholic Social Services is helping with this program? Well, we know that they're all well below the poverty level, and 95% of them are not Catholic. The home must be owned by the resident. An assessment is done by the staff to make sure each homeowner qualifies. And yes, there's a waiting list, but there's no charge for this service to those who need it. It's the kind of effort the folks at McConnell Automotive can eagerly support. There's a saying, Darwin says, love is a verb. So it's action, yeah. and that's what I love about this organization is they're taking action on, on things for people in need, and we, we love to support that at McConnell Automotive. It's where our heart is, mm -hmm. so it makes us really proud to be a supporter of this organization because they're, they're doing what they say they're about. In the book of James, it says, uh, be doers of the word, not just hearers, so that's what we're just trying to do, like living out the gospel of Christ, showing others through our actions. In Mobile, Darwin Singleton, NBC 15 News.